Oh, it's in the...
Welcome to another Michigan Esports broadcast. It's Shelby, aka Chocolate PhD, here again, and I'm joined by Shakar. Hey guys, how's it going? Hope you're having a wonderful day and are ready for a great game. Yeah, just some casual fallow on a Monday night. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited for it. We're against St. Xavier University from Chicago here today. Uh, and we're on Pearl. What do you think of the comp so far, Shakar? Uh, we've got an interesting Astra pick from Nikolai here. Haven't seen Astra in a while. Mm. Uh, we've also got a double controller over on uh, St. Xavier's side with a Viper Astra, which is also interesting. Double which controller, double meta, initiator. Though. Yeah, that is true. Yeah, yeah, I'm excited to see how it plays out, especially since we're defending first with that double initiator comp. Could, uh, could make for an interesting half. Uh, we're, they're running no duelist. It's oh going to be God, interesting to see how they entry. <laughs> well, they do have their KO there, and KO's, you know, his blinds are yeah. very helpful. <laughs> yes. It's horrible to play against KO, in my opinion, but uh, it's just me. I, for one, want to see how they entry and how they play this first round, at least. Yeah. Because they do not have any way to get through all of this util that... Yumish is going to have down already. Well, who knows what we see on this first round. I mean, I'm honestly at this point looking forward to maybe an Astro buying full stars and going full rap mode, you know, the little smoke chain. I'm, I'm honestly down to see anything right now, especially with, you know, Pearl being a newer map and being, I think, so different from a lot of the other ones we've seen. I mean, just entry on B-Site sounds horrendous to me. I don't know about you, Shikar. Yeah, especially going down the long range with little to no uh entry yeah. but like with those smokes it seems like they'll be able to push through it's like spin gets one down B. no trades coming out here from saint xavier it's been taking a lot of damage though it's like yumish has three on the flank oh my goodness i so expect just... nothing less from our team though yes spike planted Spin trying to get some shots in through the smoke. Doesn't get any damage though. Looks like Yumish has made it all the way through flank. Viper is waiting for them though. Viper will oh, get one, but will get traded. And Logic also getting one. Oh, KO in the back line. Getting uh, Spin. There, one enemy remaining. There. Nikolai trading that one out. And also getting uh, paid. Yeah, Michigan. Uh... Like, see you left in a 1v3, and just not much you can do in this round. Michigan takes the first round. I think based just on comp alone, I think, and of course that round, Michigan's going to play a little bit more aggressive here. And of course, it's always more successful in this round, but I'm hopeful to see more three-man flanking in the future. Yes, that is always exciting to see. Oh, it's Looks entertaining. Like <laughs> it's entertaining, yeah. <laughs> You've got three people walking. It looks like Yumish is gonna have a few people full by, but not the entire team. Looks like SXU is going for a full move push straight into uh, Here. Here. not shops, art. Did you hear trying an open kick with that chamber utility unfortunately takes a lot of damage through the smoke. And Nikolai left one on site. Gets one. Gets another but gets traded out by JC. You just get two. Juju in the back. Trying to hold secrets, but he gets taken out by Alruro and that stinger. One enemy low damage. And logic getting one more. JC left one stunned. Before. And doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah. Easy, Same pretty force by much. there for Michigan. Yeah, that force round is almost always gonna go to the team that already won round one. Of course. Gotta go. Let's see, SXU has their full buy, and you miss on the bonus. 
Doesn't look like they're gonna have to buy much. Oh, Spin's buying Looks up like with Spin's a Vandal. First thing, yeah. Yeah. I'm going to assume that he did not buy last round. I just bought uh, Sheriff Bullets or Headhunter Bullets. Uh, it looks like he has eight in the chamber, so no uh. pun intended. Spin <laughs> sees three in B long. Looks like SXU's a fan of five man pushes. Yeah. Really hoping to catch Machine off guard here, hoping they make a slower rotate. But, uh, Let's get Machine's caught already the here. Oh. Yeah, JC's alone on site on the plants. Oh, he gets caught out by, out by a with a dinger. Juju with a nice pick on spin. Bomb is caught out on site. So SXU will have to clear the entirety of mid and CT. They really don't have that viper anywhere wall near anymore. It. Yeah. Yeah. It looks Can like we have uh, Neon here on the flank. Yeah. And she didn't hit the trip, so they do not know that she's there. I'm, what, did she hit the trip? What the? Uh, it's still intact, so... It's still intact, have, interesting. Might have uh, Neon Sprint jumped past it, I'm assuming. Yeah, or gotten left. smoked past it. It's like... She's going for the plants here. Planted. I'm just letting it go through. Ooh, oh, Crispy gets caught out. Alaru with the sticks, it looks like SXU planted a little too far and allowed Alaru to get, get the that diffuser around the corner. <laughs> Great bonus round by you, Mish. Yeah, 100%. Both teams on a, what looks like a full buy. Except for spin. Well, spin so, of course, force last round. <laughs> he did force. It's like Juju's about to forget some armor if she doesn't buy in the next few seconds. Oh boy. Teleport's ready. Juju does not have armor on this push, and he oh, is entering. Silly mistake. Oh, spin doesn't out. hit much. Doesn't hit anyone. Hold flash out. Looks like they're five manning B yet again. It's been ready for the, the fade eye. It does not come. Yeah, this site entry is really interesting. Six of you, you're flying from far, but not doing anything with it. Making uh, Viper be the only one on site, really. Right now. Besides Team Alpha, of course. Spin easily gets them. So JC oh, puts all up and Spin gets them. <laughs> they're spraying. Oh, this is not going great for St. Xavier. Juju in the back. It looks like he's realized he's a little low on shield. Six is taking a lot of damage here. One enemy remaining. He does get one. Oh, Alru alone in a one v two. They're gonna double swing him. Looks like they're gonna play time here. Yeah. Oh, he reloads. Unfortunately, uh, Six they first never take their first round. Yeah. That was interesting to see as the SXU just picked off two of Yumish's players very quickly there and turned the tide into their advantage. Yeah. Looks like Yumish is on a half by here. Try and uh, make up for that lost round. Sandy Xavier has a lot of money in the bank though, so this is a big round if Michigan can take a safe here or thrifty. It's like a five-man A main push yet again. Face your fear! I think Xavier loves these aggressive pushes, especially for not having a duel list. Oh, stunned a few people, but still gets taken out. Spike Between Logic with a. nice couple of picks of the Stinger there. Flash out, oh, hoping to preserve his life right here. Here's one main. Mish. A 3v2, swings. Oh, Nikolai. Does not know Nikolai is out. Oh, now they do know Nikolai is in pit. Spike planted. Try and stun. One enemy remaining. Last player standing. Nikolai in a 1v1, Hatcher 1v1.
You ready for her? Park to peek out. Gets oh. caught, bro. Unfortunate loss for uh, Michigan there. So close to getting that that thrifty round and maybe trying to screw up Saint Xavier's economy there. But unfortunately, uh, it's a simple one v one. Just didn't work out. Yeah, looks like uh, Saint Xavier has that chamber alt ready on their side, so they're gonna go for the B long push with that and save and even more money. <laughs> and save more money. Six <laughs> Men's gonna play Let's very play. far up though. Maybe hoping to try Same and get that early chamber pick. Does get one, but Crispy gets traded. So 4v4, Yumish. That chamber op looking deadly, but chamber is at 46 health, so. Yumish could get a spray onto him. And Fade Saver is left without that very vital fade utility here that can get him a lot of information through these Nikolai smokes and. Quick <laughs> spin. Quick spin saw the, the gun barrel. Park and T-Bot with some trades coming in. Yeah. Back to a 2v2. We do have Astro with the health Ball. advantage. Looks like SXU is going to try and back off, cut noise a little. Not sure if they're going to leave, though. Looks like Yumish thinks they're leaving, though. Which might work in SXU's favor here. Yeah, looks like they're slowly moving up for a re-hit. Yumish playing safer back in mid. 30 seconds left. Uh, there's some trigger discipline and <laughs> taking their time. We might see the Astro Wall come out this round. <laughs> you are divided! Astro Wall has been dropped. Looks like we they've left barely enough space for plant. 10 seconds left. Spike planted. Astro has been tagged by that KO knife, so they do know. It'll be interesting to see how Yumish goes by this. Okay, looks like he's popped the ult. We see and the kill, Astro and wall. another Astro wall coming out. Chamber no longer has his ultimate. And Yumish might take it here. One oh, no, oh, with the spray control. Thanks. Able to pick off two of them and. We get the round. We defend this place all. We defend Unfortunate, this Unfortunate, uh, Logic had to lose his life, but, uh, it's best case scenario. Yeah. Yeah, so we saw both Astro Walls get pulled out there. Chamber Alt has been lost, but Chamber Alt is now being used on, uh, Yumish's side here. So we'll see what, uh, Spin can do with that. Looks like they're on, uh, on, uh, sh very shaky buy with KO Evan Spectre, half armor on El Ruro here. We do have three alts here. Chris could sell his gun and use Neon ult, but it looks like he elected to use a gun instead. Oh, oh, the timing of that. Timing. Uh, very Almost. unfortunate. KO ult denying not only his operator, but also his teleport so he could get away. Backside. And it's between logic and a 1v5. And uh can't do much. Uh, flawless from SXU here. Well played by using those ult that KO ult to get onto site. Yeah. Yeah, looks like Yumish has the Neon ult and also a fade ult ready for uh probably a retake. Uh, it looks like SXU is now deciding five manning uh, A main. Interesting choice considering oh, they've oh, succeeded on the B main push so often. Yeah. Well, this push might work out for them in favor. No one's holding A site currently, of course, between logics rotating. That Viper orb lineup. Yeah, are there... now just stuck. Oh, and Nikolai, oh. the pretty bad Cut up by there. All five. Yeah, the fire. No one is holding. I mean, logic. Oh, 
Oh, oh, there. <laughs> it's relatable. Unlucky. We're very low. Very low KO. Oh. Both teams here. You mission uh three v four. That uh two v four. Oh, it's not looking good for Michigan here. Between logics, one HP. But is he able to get JC miraculously? A room with a really nice trade. You have got to be the kidding. timing is not in his favor. One enemy remaining. Oh, he does get both, but no, he, he does, does not get have time both to of them. Wow. That was an interesting double swing for a Messick to you. Yeah, they just lined right up. <laughs> they do lose both guns, but I believe their economy is pretty yeah, stable over there. Yeah, it doesn't matter at this point. <laughs> you All of them could have an op if they really wanted to. And we are seeing an op-by here coming in from Juju. Thing. Yumish still on uh, light shields with vandals, so uh, looks like they're they're trying to stabilize their economy, but it's not happening with these back and forth with losses. With did uh, Chris SXU. use the neon alt last run? He did not. I don't believe so. Oh, he might have. I just did not hear it. It's like spin has been. Uh, all commanded. Face oh, your not. fear! Nah, he shot the knife. Now. I think he with another aggressive push on a beaming. You're sitting with a nice early pick. Blitz trading it. I think you is retreating slowly but surely. Between logic with a nice pick. Juju's still holding for Nikolai to swing the corner. Nikolai is stuck. He takes oh. a lot of damage. He does manage to get into backside. Oh, barely the timing. That off shot. <laughs> it's like SXC is deciding to go back into their spawn and maybe rotate towards mid array, but uh, Crispy is sitting in uh, in their spawn area near mid. Gigi is hoping to get a pick here. If you wish over thirty PC seconds on left. B. So Crispy is very unsure. He does he gets taken out by Park Geo. It looks like that's gonna trigger SXU to run towards A and also Yumish to rotate. The Astro all pulled out. Looking to run out probably and get this plant down as quickly as possible. Ten seconds left. Nikolai swings through. Does stop the plant. Spike down A. Time is down. That's time. Did they really think they could scare me? Good play from Yumish there. Is that a half buy or a force for Yumish? That was a force. It looked like they, they forced light shields. Okay, well, and, it worked in their favor. And, yeah, assault rifles. Looks like they're going to go again with that. We are Spin. seeing St. Xavier's economy start to falter a little bit because of that. Uh, Hopefully they can are able to keep this momentum. Yeah, looks like Spin's gonna stick with his headhunter for this round. And here they come B main again. Does not get any picks. Is forced to teleport. Oh, get some damage out. A lot of unnecessary damage though to Juju. Double smoke is down. Looks like SXU's very grouped up again, getting ready to execute. Chris shot down. their smoke on Park. Flashed out. One's already behind generator. Chris, Chris has the read on it. Spike plan. Getting the Viper on their enemy smoke. Remaining. And Spin finishes off their round with his headhunter. Yeah, great round from Yumish. Resetting their econ. Really damaging as use. Yeah, especially with that continuous operator buy. It's not gonna look pretty next round. Uh, looks like Spin is gonna be utilizing the operator as a chamber would. Crispy with that 3k, bringing uh, putting him on the board. Uh, interesting. New new strategy from SXU. We are now split pushing into mid. I didn't see it. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like
like Yimish is prepared for it though. <laughs> Actually, we might get a little over aggressive here. There. First repositioning as uh, they make their way towards art. A very heavy art push, in fact. They are not split pushing anything, Shikar. Yeah, no, sp <laughs> no splits. Oh, they don't have a duelist. That is true. Yeah, they does not catch anyone. Oh man, looks like SXU is <laughs> full retreating toward the Merlin. Oh my goodness. There are one can get happy picks family, out here. Aren't they? Oh, Spin does, does get one. Can you pull a second one, though? It's the real question. Viper wall does go down. Oh. Looks like they're trying. Oh, he does he get two and TPs sniper. away. 3v2 with a KO very low for SXU here. Spin trying to get to third. Misses. Oh, misses, gets taken out by JC. Aruro getting JC through the, through the wall and t bop through the wall as well. 3v1 for SXU. It's triple swan. Just double swing. <laughs> Yeah. Great round from Gimish there. Last Those two picks from half. Spin really setting up the round for them. Yeah. Looks like he's gonna buy another up or pick up, get the up back at least. We got one more round uh, in this half, and it looks like SXU's not on their best buy. It looks like they're forcing as best they can, but they do not have much. They do have that chamber up though, which will allow one more weapon to be given yes. to the rest of the team. And we don't have KO's ultimate anymore, so there's no denying that. Yes. Looks like Spin also has his up ready as well. And has it popped. You want to play? Let's We have play. another five minute aggressive push from Michigan here. But we have three on site already. Uh, KO grenade already coming out from Yumish. Trying to hold back the push. Face your Looks like they got the fade ult out. And they're just gonna run it. Oh, oh, between what? logic getting all five <laughs> as they try oh and run out. God. Some incredible spray <laughs> Logic yeah. himself is um, surprised. <laughs> yeah, Yumish ending the round, uh, ending the half, eight four. And quite confidently, I, I think you could add as well. I mean, that's got to make logic feel good. That's got to be an eagle. Yeah. Morale on SXU side's gotta go, gotta go yeah. a little down from that. It's, that is some of the fastest aces I've ever seen in a while. Yeah. Oh. That would... See, Yumish going for four B main and just sending spin out alone into mid to try and pull a, pu pull a pick. You will see spin here lurking a little bit towards mid. Looks like they're using the same smoke that gone. SXU was using earlier to get across. Get suppressed. Oh, suppressing, suppressing chamber, which is good for them. Coming through! Go, go, go! Just be with the wall. Flash out. An actual entry. <laughs> we are seeing all of Michigan taking sight here. No one is being left behind. Looks like Spin is still in mid. Gets yeah. taken out by T-Bob. It's like Blitz just barely gets Chris timing. Nice Crispy with two and Aruro with two as well. Finishing out the round. Another yeah, great clean round for Michigan. Yeah, seeing some great work from uh, between Logic here in this game. Really yeah. get, getting his picks. Michigan is very coordinated on this map between gathering info and then Chris taking the space from that info. It's really well played. Yeah, for how new this map is to the pool itself, it's great to see that Yumish is uh, faring very well. Especially with the recent changes that occurred. Spin oh, about to catch out one. Two of them. Just two. Looks like the other three are also coming in on flank here. We'll get caught oh, out by the chamber TP. By the chamber trip. And Spin's just running down B. <laughs> As we can see on the B map. 
Will I get one? JC with a trade in. Oh, between logic with the whiff. See, it's always logic with the need. Chris does. Oh, with the Phantom Force buy on second round. All right. Definitely some ego boosting going on here, Michigan side. We just see there how valuable that lurk was. I'm very curious to see what would be different if Saint Xavier used some of that strategy in their own attacking half. Yeah, as opposed to sending all five down main, down. leaving yeah. like a lurk, maybe splitting. It's like Yumish is going to try and run into um, in through doors, but it's denied by that KO grenade, turning their eyes towards art. No one in art holding at the moment, but there's one a fade on stairs, ready, ready to catch anyone off, off guard. So Kimish is trying to make a decision here on where to push, either towards A or B. Unsure. Looks like they're gonna try and go towards B now. Oh, Chris doing a lot of damage to team up there, <laughs> and finishes him out in mid connector. I'm out of here. No, you've got Juju on site uh, or up towards pillar alone. Uh, pushed up and Geo on site. Also. Trying to get one, managed to get a little, catches him out. Oh, Crispy Juju. turns on to Juju. <gasps> well, park with oh, the trade, man. of course. Last player standing. Oh, JC just Fire walks out. Planted. Does not get any. 3v1 for Blitz here. Michigan has a ton of utility. He's gonna be tough. He's getting crossfired from both uh, backside and main. Does not look like he'll be able to walk out at all. It won't be easy. At this point, I'd save. <laughs> he is stuck in that corner, so as soon as he crosses, it's a little... Oh, I oh, see. Just whiffs on spin. Yeah. 11, of course, four, Nikolai would have traded it out no matter what. Peeking out there, but... Looks like, like SXU is starting a timeout. Time Trying to reevaluate their strategy. Get a... Get a grip on what they're doing and stop Yumish's uh, momentum. Momentum. A hundred percent. Oh, Pat. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> yes, everyone. We should say our lovely spectator Pat is joining us. Um, hopefully, now you guys have a bit more entertaining spectator now that I'm not doing it. <laughs> but uh, Pat definitely has a sense of humor, don't you? <laughs> Great mural on the wall here. We've got uh, the koi fish. fish. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> fish boat. Interesting. Fish bus, more like. <laughs> Getting a real close up of these brush strokes. The uh, Valorant artist that designed this mural is getting a. Uh, a lot of screen time. <laughs> you know, during a normal timeout, we talk about strategy in the new meta, but <laughs> I think the mural is far more important. That's a good <laughs> uh, Let's see if SXU decides to change anything up in their, you in their know, play style. I'm not gonna lie, I don't think they will. They yeah. didn't change their attack oh, strategy. Yeah, their, for their play style has very much changed. They've got five on A now. Oh my goodness. Uh, well, it's a chance that they um, that they lost. When we've got four going They're B. All going B. <laughs> B is clear, so. Yumish uh, will get this site for free. Looks like Asher's gonna try and rotate fast. But not much four of XXU solo, though. Four of XXU still you trying to rotate through mid. <laughs> yeah, free site for Yumish. You do have the rotation coming in from SXU though. Chris getting a little overzealous here. Did some damage because of it. That'll teach him a lesson. Rick staying a little too far. Oh, we've got spin oh, but on has the, the flank. timing. Oh, the timing for oh, three oh, of oh. them. Uh, gets one. Does get one. Does damage. He gets second. He gets second. Gets two. Last one oh. stuck here. And spin with a nice 3k and a very nice lurk. Mm -hmm. Match point for you, Mish. Match point. Well, I don't think the timeout worked out for them. What do you think? No. Seems like 
They tried to revert to their old five stack strategy. Did not yes. work well. Something I see a lot in my elo. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like they've reverted reverted again to their yeah. original defense strategy of Astro I mean, just sitting in spawn. You can just look at the scoreboard. I mean St. Xavier's just getting carried by their 17 and 4 whomever. And <laughs> for Michigan's a lot more even. We have KO and our fave with 10 and 12 assists oh, respectively. So it's just a skill diff, honestly. It's a team diff. Yeah. Between logic getting two, but oh. Arc getting Nikolai as well, leaving you mission a 4v3 situation. Yeah. Chris down their smokes. Very low HP here. Yeah, looks like we're gonna see a push out from mid and also uh, see Juju trying to come through CT. That operator, but Crispy's got the timing. He sees it. Oh, Chris might go for the knife here. Oh, I think oh. better though. Last player standing. Oh my goodness. Oh. And there's some whiffs coming through again from Logic, as you know, we love him all the same. Oh, oh, oh. Missing the off shot. shot. Oh, out gets shot. caught out. That's XQ getting the first round on and off. Wow. I'm proud. On defense. Maybe the timeout did work. They just needed a round Perhaps. of practice, you know? Yeah, looks like Yumish is no longer gonna go in, though. There! After that, that loss. No, no, no. Uh, uh, it's almost unlucky. I mean, if Chris hit the shot, game over. But uh, uh, you can't leave everything up to Chris, can you? Yes, I take that back. Yumish is now stacking forward towards A main and sending uh, 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 yeah, spin to mid. Of course, spin lurking again. Where are yeah, the spin they? lurk? Coming I'd out. hope at some point a Saint Xavier would be able to catch the the lurk. You want to I play? Hope. Let's play. Looks like Spin's got his chamber off out. We do have two more alts on the side of Yumish with Neon alt and Fade alt to try and take sight, maybe. And we also have the KO ult, which has been popped by uh, SXQ here to try and slow down Yumish's push. We do have a Fade ult and an Astral wall oh, in the works. JC taking a lot of damage through this nice wall. Try. It's taken down by Crispy. Spike planted. The nice little right kick. Yumish gets the point down. Crispy gets the off. Uh, gets a little overzealous though. Park trades. T-Bob yeah. last night. Nice like on row. Spins lurk mid coming in handy. Yes, and it's all up to park here in a 3v1. He sees Spin. Spin sees him. Taking that back. You do have Astro Wall in play. Oh, taking a lot of damage through that wall. But uh, it's park against the clock right now, honestly. And yeah. Yumish just has win. their utility together and finishes up the round and the game. Yeah, great first game from Yumish here. Interesting to see that SXU's strategy on attack was five manning without a without a duelist entry. So yeah, yeah, very curious because they did they do double initiator and double controller. Wow. Yeah, it seemed like they're trying to rely on the mass of util that they would throw at Umish to distract them enough, but a hundred percent. It did not work work out for them. And Yumish coming out on top for game one. I mean, I mean, just look at that park, Geo and Astra carrying the rest of his team. Uh, uh, unfortunately, can't do that much on Astra. Yeah. Now, imagine park playing Reyna or Duelist. I don't know. Game would be very different. Yeah. 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 Yeah, we'll just give it a right. We'll be right back. Well... <laughs> Uh, we'll be right back. Looks like <laughs> the teams are also taking a break. Oh, Pat. <laughs>
Welcome back, everyone, to game two of our CFAL best of three against St. Xavier. We are now on bind. Uh, Yumish is attacking, of course. Uh, St. Xavier defending. I love bind. How about you, Shakar? Uh, I have a very different opinion on bind. Oh, please do share. I'm oh so curious. I do not like bind whatsoever. Bind is down there with fracture on my list of maps. What? But... I do enjoy watching spin on bind, especially with that raise. <laughs> yeah, the raise is pretty entertaining. I just got to see it last Saturday, but that is that feels almost sacrilegious, Shakar. <laughs> bind is a great map. Wow, we um, see some mirror comps. Yeah, is it the same? It is. Yeah. Well, I guess the meta is made clear then here, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. And at this point, it's just a matter of the players and. Uh... Compatibility of the teams, which we saw Yumish did a fantastic job of last game, so hopefully it continues into this game and we just be on our merry way. Yeah. Looks like Yumish is going to try and set up for a B push first. And it seems that uh, SXU is playing the default 2B 3A as most people do on bind. Hmm. We'll we'll see how this chamber rotates around because usually before his nerf we would see chamber trying to rotate between A and B as constantly as possible. But now we'll see how, how he plays it. I think he's gonna push up and try and get that pick on no one existing there in uh, A main. Oh you miss making a lot of noise as they run into hookah. Molly coming out from uh, the brimstone on SXU and Sky rotating to try and give support on B site. The dog coming out from a very far away place. Let's not get any info on you, Mission, whatsoever. Yeah, I've never seen a dog wave up before. Spin with a nice, easy early pick on a T Bob. Logic with another one as well. Spin with a second. He's getting the second on pick. A fade. Site cleared, one coming out of TP. Crispy has seen him go right. He's holding for that pick. Last long player spin. taking a lot of damage, and Chris just finishes him out. It's all up for Yeah, 1v5 gets taken up by Nick. Flawless first round for you, Mish. Yeah. Uh, Pat, can we take a look at the scoreboard real quick? I saw a new name from SXU that I'm not sure if I saw before. Am I crazy, or was their fade not here before? Am I just yeah, misremembering? Yeah, Sentiser is new. Hmm, interesting, interesting. Looks like they've subbed in Sentiser over 
do not remember who was in last game. Yeah, I couldn't tell you, but hopefully everyone's okay. Everyone's doing fine, and uh, no one's stressed from homework. Um, <laughs> and hopefully Saint will maybe bring something we didn't see last game. We shall see. Yep. See, par uh, part two also is gearing up to push up again with Juju. Oh, looks like they're caught up by the dog and the shorty. Spin getting one with a judge by... And also very much... Oh, Nick uh, getting another one. Archie was already low from that uh, judge encounter, so easy kill for Nikolai. Enticer. Both in CT. Oh, Spin getting two more. What a round. That was a very quick round from Yumish there. Did not... Uh, it seems that SXU did not expect to get judged down. It looks like Spin's trying to no, not at all. go that for was that 13-0. One quick round. Holy. <laughs> hmm. Looks like SXU is now setting up 3B with uh, Chamber going long. We do have that buy, Juju oh. getting one. Very early really. pick on the Chris there. Yeah, really slowing down Yumisha's push. Looks like, looks like Yumisha's gonna persevere through though. Yeah, t -Bow taking a lot of damage from Spin's nade there. Michigan has sight. Spin. Yeah, Spin already in U-Haul. Aru, maybe we'll get T-Bow here. Get Let's another get one and backs down. up. There is one more backside, Juju, trying to, trying to get anyone who overextends. Does manage to get a Ruro. Uh, Finn and uh, Finn Logic are both playing U-Haul. Nikolai rotated all the way over to Showers. Nikolai might have trying. the timing here on Showers. Oh, oh Logic, Logic gets one. Nice pick. Nikolai with the timing. Nikolai with the timing. And Logic getting one Help more as well as Finn. Great round from Yumish again. Great bonus. Yeah, taking that third round. Yeah, really. That's gonna hurt. That's uh, the economy for sure. Yeah, there we go. Well, I mean, Spin's just caring at this point. Seven and zero, yeah. two assists. Uh, I mean, that judge round really did help with that, though, didn't it? <laughs> yeah, four K on the judge. Spin's having a having a great time of it. Yumish is. Econ looking pretty strong, even if they drop a few guns this round. Looks like they're gonna go for that B split. Wonder how they're gonna deal with the chamber standing on boxes on their left. Oh, looks like they've spotted him and spotted the edge of Brim inside the tube. Alruro with the eye lineup. Ready? Oh, Nikolai getting that pick onto Marchio. Lineup coming out. Yumish. The picks are just coming in and in. Yeah, Yumish, while well over the machine coming out of long. Chris holding Crispy. that flank on Juju. And Nikolai. Oh. Oh, t -Bop. Nikolai does get taken out by T-Bop as he goes in the wrong direction. Or not Nikolai. Spin, excuse me. Yeah. Spin. Yeah, Nikolai getting the getting the trade out though. 4 0, Yumish. This could just be a bloodbath. Yeah. You really taking a beating here. They do have money for those guns. So it looks like both teams are on a full buy here. Might be missing some Utah, it seems. Yeah, they're. Uh, no, I don't think so. Possibly here. I think the most concerning thing, though, rather than missing utilities, missing kills here. And that's something Sandy Saber's wanting yeah. to make up for in this round. Like Parchio is pushed up yet again, taking a Might lot of damage from that. Oh yeah, yeah force TP, no damage from that nade though. Looks like Yumish is very uh, set on this B push at the moment. Juju on the flank does see the the trip, has no way to get around it, but is holding for that that rotate perhaps. You can actually jump crouch past it. There. Fun fact yeah. for all the viewers. I've got your train. Spin's gonna run out. Molly. Molly coming out. Nice. Spin does. does rose all there in a, a way. Yeah. Two for two trade. And oh, one for one trades. Looks like Yumish is in a two v two. 
And they're just gonna leave? No. Oh, just TP yeah, out. Chris is Chris. already in their spawn. Probably gonna catch yeah. T-Bop here off guard. One enemy and remaining. he does. Yeah, he's not ready. <laughs> Juju coming in from uh, T-Spawn. Like, they do know though. Uh, Trip is gone now. It's like they don't know. They're playing for uh, all angles. Juju does come out with the ult. Also uh, misses. What a waste of eight all points. <laughs> yeah. Nade! Okay, Nade does go out into heaven. They're just gonna double swing. Uh, Crispy with the kill. Molly. Well played by Michigan. Yeah. <laughs> Minus 250 with that. That Molly usage. But yeah. It's okay. <laughs> Mish is pretty I think eight rich. all points is a, is a little bit more wasteful there, <laughs> especially with Michigan's economy. <laughs> Looks like FXU's on uh, on a half by this round. Oh, they're they're forcing. Looks like they might be forcing here. Interesting choice. Watch and learn. It's like the only they're one off of uh, fade ults, and they do have that sky ult ready to go. Uh, Umish also has Sky Alt already, already ready. Yeah, we have uh, two alts here on Michigan side with Fade and Brim. Uh, I'm interested to see how Zane oh, Xavier makes, makes their uh, economy go to use. Juju taking a lot of unnecessary damage there. It's been just finishing him out. Park is up here in Lamp, so taking a lot of space, but Logic just takes him down. Like, like, able to get the plan off, <laughs> of course, spin. Putting it off a little bit. <laughs> Spike planted. This Last might be another standing. flawless for Michigan. Oh, oh, same with the nice shot though. I spoke too soon, excuse it me. Spoke a little too soon. Uh, spin getting the last kill. Yeah. Well, leave it to spin, right? <laughs> Six oh humish. I mean spit on rays is just oh, a sight to behold oh. on the top. So Saint Xavier taking their timeout. A very early timeout here. Now the question is, is there a mural on buying for us to see? Pat, can you take us to a mural? That's Bray Pat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this this will be interesting to see what SXU has planned. It might be just to slow down Yumish's momentum, it might just be to Change their entire setup for uh, how they're playing. I mean, either way, a timeout here isn't the worst strategy for St. Xavier. I mean, let's just take a look at the scoreboard here. Um, Pat. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you just see and kills, you know, the most St. Xavier has to compete with is two, two spins, 12. So um, it really just a matter <laughs> of maybe using that utility, solving that push, because Michigan always takes sight, always, no matter what. So if there's anything to die, it would be that plant. Thank you for the mural, Pat. <laughs> there's a lot of fish in Valorant, isn't there? <laughs> I'm just starting to notice this. <laughs> Someone really likes seafood. Uh, Harper, I'm sure. Who is <laughs> yes, our newest Valorant agent? Well, I'm excited to see um, in pro play soon, uh, if at all. He's not that good, in my opinion, but it's okay. I think he's great. Looks like you mission going for a five man long. Oh, Chris, it's too get, early. Get, and get uh, two. Nikolai could just heal him if he wants. Yeah, Juju again on the flank. Uh, they they know he's there, though. They do know he's there. Got one in TP. <laughs> oh, Juju taken out. Does Nikolai even care about healing this man? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Between logic back. trapped. Oh no. <laughs> but keep up. is stuck in CT. Does get one on spin. Spin gets a little cocky there, alright. And uh, logic just Between logic out. cleans up. You want to play? Zero human. Oh, whoa. That. What? What do we just? He what just I he just popped the popped the chamber ult at the end of the round. Got some oh. DM. Oh my gosh, Kristen. Crisp did did pop his ult. I I hope it was an accident. I know I've done that many a time on accident, but uh, be a little disrespectful. It's a little a little too disrespectful. <laughs> <laughs> 
Thanks, Dave. We just wanted to have a nice, easy game. And here we are. <laughs> They're always <doing. laughs> It's like San Xavier does have a buy here. Juju with an early push in a TP. Which, I don't know if it'll work. Yeah, he is pretty much trapped here. Fire in <laughs> and he gets oh he just barely survives that was an that was a great strat from you mish actually like opening the tp how did spit oh yeah did they send he is over? opening the tp from the with the bird that's yeah, with great the bird. A really great strategy yeah, sincere logic here Still with in. the remote coming out bring them down yeah, since you're stuck in elbow Enticer. I don't know how to say his name. She is able to get the plant on. I'm just going with sand. This man has been with a kill through smoke. Oh, the trade. With the Chris trade wins the other trade. Yeah. 4v2, you missed. Oh, Chris. Oh, T Bop getting one and Saint's getting one, one, getting one as well. Nikolai getting, getting T Bop, leaving Saint Sir in a 1v2. Uh, 1v2. Dog comes out. He has been revealed. Flash and double swung. Well, good secure round for Michigan. They were getting a little overzealous, I think. They could tone it down a bit. They're losing unnecessary lives, in my opinion. But uh, they're having fun anyways and have lots of money, so doesn't matter. Yeah. Probably not. Looks like Crisp is coming out with the, with the operator buy. And also Juju on the other team. Interesting choice of who to give the operator to. Yeah, it's a very Where interesting buy here. I mean, we have Park constantly saving here. Oh, actually, they decided to force instead. Probably a good choice. Park was an amazing player last game. The team MVP for St. Xavier getting, what, 17 kills on Astra? Now we see one chamber in the, the fourth. Isn't as exciting. Yeah, Logic Juju killed really out front with that off. Ooh, been Park getting traded out. Pins. Park getting Does one get more. Load. You missed down a man. Oh, really with a park. really great pick. T Bop is already out of the lamps and gets out of Ruro. 5 HP backs up. Does not have much to work with there. Oh, Crisp getting one in backside and now is holding U Haul for uh, T Bop's peak here. And he is, he's one tap. A wall that here can. One enemy remains. Uh, between Logic getting uh, getting <laughs> both. Gets his little 3k, finishes it out. 9-0, you miss. Interesting game we're seeing here. It's getting a little hard to watch, I'll be honest. Yeah. It seems that JC and Juju are not having the, the greatest game of their... I mean, no team. one on San Xavier really is. No I mean, one's Michigan's having a great game. constantly denying them. Everyone on our team is getting picks left, right, and center. I mean, I'm Spin and Logic just utility isn't crazy. popping off. Yeah. I mean, are we surprised, though? Logic was an incredible ace last round. Spin on Chamber with some of the best first bloods I've seen in a while. Mm -hmm. It's like... Six like... strategy has changed to crossfires. Yeah, is Xavier on another force buy? I mean, Spin gets the same with Spike the nade. down, oh, B. No. Uh, Park getting one, but getting traded out by Nick. Oops, been trying to push up for that. They oh, that's a judge, though. Here. And JC's, JC's gonna getting... get his first pick of the game. <laughs> Looks like Yumish is gonna take the TP and run into A, which is surprisingly cleared right now. Uh, Nikolai finally decides to heal his teammates. <laughs> <laughs> Nikolai is pretty low on health here, though. Yeah. Five this is this hop shot on uh, Juju, who came through TP. Looks like all of St. Xavier is trying to uh, push through the flank. Juju yeah. getting one, gets traded out. 2v2 for you, Mish. And options JC here, and T-Bob for St. Xavier. Get the flash off. Oh, like sky flash straight. Oh, just gets, just gets hit with for that last little bit. And we Logic's do have the burn ult. The time. Open up the sky. Boomstone ult's out. Oh, those strike. One enemy remaining. Oh, T-Bop caught out looking the wrong way. Begin here. And Logic's ready. Oh, no, does play the time and gets the kill. <laughs> Logic with a nice fix. He does go down though for the bomb. Yumish's economy is. 
very healthy. Yeah. I mean, even when things are looking in Saving Saber's favor, it's, there's always something. There's that Brimald or Molly or <laughs> Chris with an op, <laughs> you know, there's always something. <laughs> Looks like Sonic Xavier gonna... going for yet another force. Yeah, I don't know about all these forces, Shakar. They're not working. Uh, no, <laughs> I feel like a, taking a second, taking a full save here. Yeah, or would, even a Bucky really buy. I mean, we saw last round how much, you know, Spin even was pushing into Hookah. A Bucky there would have killed him just as well as the Spectre would have. And it's half the amount of money. Yeah, the the shotgun buys are really undervalued on this map, especially with all these close corners. There's so, so many close corners. And with as good as a mental Yimish has right now, who knows if they're even gonna check those corners. Yeah. Looks like we do have a, a judge. Oh, Juju taken out from all the way from the bench. Uh, judge will not see much use today. Oops. Looks like Spin, spin has it will. now, so it will see like use. Spin will get some <laughs> use. <laughs> JC getting, uh, getting through backside. One enemy remaining. Oh, last one sitting in CT with the Spectre. Uh, See if Saint Sentizer can get any get any kills here. Uh, well, Looks like he will get one. Again, so. But shorted, shorted think, by spin. I think Logic is the best. Last for round him. before the switch. <laughs> I think he could win that title. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I've I mean, seen that combined thirty-three kills from our from our top two at Umish. Oh. Eleven and zero. This team is just unmatched, I suppose. Uh, Yumish on bind, very, very together. Okay. Very, uh, very coordinated. You do again with the early teleport. Yeah. It looks like this time it's seen. Hey. doesn't die! <laughs> yeah, but it does get Nikolai and, and it spin does a lot of damage, out. so Juju gets taken out. This might be the aggression we yeah, needed from yeah. Saint Xavier to win around. Of course, Alru with a pick on Saint. Tiny on Michigan, on Michigan side. No one's on site though. Everyone no is behind there. Michigan. Yeah, it looks like Michigan knows that site is clear here. They do not know First what's going on. First pick on T-Bob. There's no yeah. more heals for Saint Xavier. No more replies or dogs. It looks like three going yeah, into Hukka are going to try and play together for this pick. Or and for very this retake. loudly, might I say. Yeah. Saving Xavier is never afraid of giving up information. Especially when it comes to a, a round like this one. Aru <laughs> evens it out so evenly. It's yeah, logical. Aru with, with a great... Aru with a great positioning. Molly! Like Park will not get and Chris a to jump out. The angle, but able to push out. Wow, uh, a perfect half for Michigan. Will it be a perfect Switching game? Switching sides. Match point. Uh, looks like Spin is going to put all his effort into making that 13-0 spray come to uh, fruition. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Really living up to, to We are spray. seeing a shorty buy here from Spin. Maybe we'll get him a 4k like the judge did. Uh, I'm Perhaps. Hoping. Yeah, it looks like uh, St. Xavier is going for the same split B push that Yumish went on round one. Uh, Yumish is playing three towards B, two on A. Uh, the only switch I see here is the, the fade is now playing on A as opposed to St. Xavier's fade playing on B. Yeah. Bring them down. It has very similar setups. We found one. Because we will be forced to teleport that big dog. Logic not not spotted yet. Yeah. down. Oh, beat. spin getting one. Oh, and it's a one v four. Oh, it's a one v four. Does have very all the blinds, but spin's got the short. Oh. Spin's just gonna run away, go around. Not looking good here for Saint Xavier. Uh, almost no. impossible, I'd say. Bop alone in the corner, unsure of what to do. Crispy about to pick the corner. Oh, gets taken out. 1v3. This is a possibility. Does have a minute to try and get some semblance of an idea of where to go. He is getting flanked by overall. He's gonna push up here. Oh, and he's gonna be sneaky about it too. <laughs> it's almost he's gonna mean. wait it out. 
gets and, the pick. 13 uh, 0 from you, Mish. No whiffs there. Uh, what a blowout for Michigan. Uh, looks like Michigan's very together on bind. Yeah. Uh, yeah, they were I the same way last, last match. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I think that's their wow. pick. Oh man, that 176 econ rating from Logic. That's insane. I mean, that's that just shows how much that Brim utility was helping in those rounds. And mm -hmm. Spin, with, of course, with six first bloods, I think says a lot. Yeah, almost 485 ACS. What a great game from you, Mish. Yeah, a ridiculously <laughs> good game. Ending the series 2-0. Michigan moves on. All right, well, I think that's all we have to say about this best of three. I think it's pretty self-explanatory just from the way Michigan played, um, how well that went for them and how happy they should be after that performance. Should we leave it there, uh, Shakar? Uh, yeah, that was a great night of Valorant, great Monday night of Valorant from you, Mish. Yeah, and, a quick uh, and easy one for sure. Yeah. Well, we will see you all next time Michigan plays. Thank you all for joining us. It was lovely to have you. And...